This break is brought to you by Netflix. For a free 30-day trial, head over to netflix.com forward slash Gamebreaker TV. Now, a new feature called Guild Missions is being introduced into Guild Wars 2 during the February update at the end of this month. And our very own Richie Procopio is here to share a bit more information about this new feature with us. So, Richie, up to now, we haven't had a huge amount of information on Guild Missions, but what have we learned? So Colin Johansson did an interview with MMORPG.com, and he kind of you know, gave us some more insight into it, which is cool. He basically said that guilds can work to unlock different guild missions that they can spawn somewhere in the world. And uh, these missions can be performed by members of the guild, and also some parts of it can actually be joined by anyone who happens to be in the area. So one example they gave was there's a, a type called Guild Rush, which allows you to spawn a timer, basically, and there's a an objective. No details were given, but the number of there's a there's a number of times that objective has to be completed within a certain time period, and if it's successful, then everybody gets rewarded uh, for successfully completing it. Now the, they mentioned that the guilds themselves can actually get like guild wide bonuses to give members. The guild members who contributed get individual guild rewards and also the people outside uh, of the guild can also get some individual rewards for doing this. So overall, it sounds like a pretty cool system. Yeah, wow, there's a ton of stuff in there. That sounds really good. So hang on. Uh, you mentioned some guild rewards and some also some individual rewards. So did, they, did they give any specific examples at all? Yes, he gave two specifics. He said that one of the things that they, you might be able to unlock from the guild uh, is lower waypoint costs, so you can teleport around the world for a cheaper price, which is pretty cool. Mm. And uh, in terms of an individual reward, he mentions the ability, uh, like some sort of toy item, the ability to actually turn into your guild banner. <laughs> wow. Like, actually, your character turns into your guild banner? Yes, so I guess it could be a, a different way of being like, haha, our guild yeah. killed, you, killed you or something. Yeah, and... exactly. That's a really <laughs> cool idea. I love it. So, okay, so you guys have spoken to quite a few times on Guildcast about how there needs to be more reasons to get together with your actual guild. Do you think this feature is going to help? Yeah, I, I do. Right right now, the only reason that you really could, you know, for, for a guild to get together is if your your guild is focused on world versus world. There's not much of a PvE uh, reason to do it. I mean, sure, you can get together and do dungeons, but that only takes five people. It does not require a guild. So, yeah, I, I think uh, having this kind of system where you can actually create content in the game as a guild, right? You can. It's mm. not only just for your guilds. For Anybody can participate in these things. I think it's going to go a long way. Of course, we'll have to see... You know, we have to see it and play it and before we see, uh, you know, how, how much of a game changer this is. But it sounds really like it has a lot of potential. So it's excellent. Yeah, absolutely. It sounds like a really great idea. And of course, you have to sort of try these things out to see how the implementation goes. Well, thank you so much for that, Richie. It sounds really interesting. And do keep it dialed to Gamebreaker TV for all your Guild Wars 2 news. And of course, don't forget to watch Guildcast every Wednesday at 6 p.m. Pacific. We'll see you there. Thanks for watching.